yes, you with the team? I'm excited to be out there. You know, another opportunity to get better. I haven't been out there since uh, first three days of spring, but um, I'm back out there healthy, ready to go. Do you feel kind of like the forgotten man in the backfield? Seems like everybody's talking about Nick now, and then Keith Marshall making his comeback, but sort of like, hey, uh, remember me? Yeah, uh, like, nah, I mean that's not something that actually. That's, I'm surprised because I, I haven't really thought about that. Me being a forgotten man, but <laughs> I mean it's not really about me. I don't know. It's, I don't know about those guys, but you know, we try to focus on team. We're trying to build leadership right now. That's one of our big goals. Is this still in the plans for you to work on special teams? I know you did a lot of that early last season, and we're very successful at it. Is that? An injury concern for the coaches? Do you plan on being out there making tackles again? Uh, I'll try to. I'm gonna work hard so I can earn a starting spot on every special team. You know, right now I'm on the list. I'm on the depth chart and working my way up and trying to be a starter on each one of those phases. What was your injury exactly in the spring that kept you out? Uh, fracture scapula. And what was that? The same shoulder? Yeah. And uh, what, how would you describe the first injury? Um, broken shoulder blade or? Uh, yeah, broken shoulder blade. So the, 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 same the same thing. thing. Yeah, same thing. The same thing. So you, you just can... aggravated the shoulder injury in spring. Yes. That's what happened. Okay. Is there any concern about that being a, a chronic issue? Or uh, no it's concern. Issue. I just, this is how my shoulder pads was fitted. I had it too, too much, my shoulder was too much exposed. And now I just got some new shoulder pads, so I'll be ready to go. You feel just as comfortable in those new pads? Or? Yes. And just as confident. Yes. yes. What, what do they entail? Do they like, uh, spend, how, how long does it take to fit shoulder pads to make sure they're not like that? Uh, not that long. It's just a, a 30, I say 30 minute process, no more than 30 minutes. In terms of the all season program, I mean, how, you know, we, we've talked to a lot of guys about how their bodies have changed in terms of, you know, Coach Hockey's new, you know, new program. How, how did you, how did you change? I mean, how, how did you, you know, work your way into it? Uh, Coach Hockey program, it was just one of those systems that, Everybody on this team bought into it. It's not one person on the team that I can name that didn't buy into the system. And that's all his program was built around. It was just built around leadership. And we were really trying to just teach everybody on the team how to be leaders from freshmen to seniors. What's your weight now compared to what you played at last year? Uh, my weight right now is probably just like three pounds higher. I played at 205 last year. I'm at 208 right now. Best you failed ever right now this year? Oh, yeah, best I felt. Yeah. We talk about special teams. Play. Does that include you wanting to return kicks again this year? I know uh, you had a yeah, big I, one that got called back, unfortunately, for you. But Yeah, I try to return kicks, but, you know, I, we got a superhero yeah. back there. I just had you kids. <laughs> I'm excited. I hope I'm back there. I'm on it just to be able to block for him. Right? If I'm on it to block for him, I'll be excited. You call Mackenzie Joyce because he goes all over the place, but in a straight 100-yard dash, so to speak, who would win? You or you would win. Win? Yeah, he'll win. By how much? I don't know. <laughs> you probably went by I mean, a good bit. Yeah. So he's that impressive out there. Yeah. yeah. Back to Isaiah. I mean, he, he's a guy. I mean, he, he had the suspension in the last year, but but Coach Rick was real complimentary of him in, in the spring about how he had kind of come along as a player. How do you see? How do you see him? How, how do you see how he's grown up since he's been to Georgia? You know, what what improvements has he made to his game? I mean, is he going to be a guy that can help you guys on offense? Yeah, Isaiah from high school to college. I've seen so much improvement in his growth and. He just get better and better every year, and it's just like wow, because he's learning the game. He's really a student of the game. He know the playbook. He's out there teaching those young guys, hey, run this. He's a leader also. That's one thing I see. I sit back and I just observe. I, I kind of like to observe, and I just see him really building. 